The IV solution that your baby will first receive on admission is called Total Parenteral Nutrition. It's a solution that adds additional protein, calories, and fats to your baby's diet. Because your baby is so sick and not breathing, he cannot eat very much food volume at that point. So what we do is place a central line. There are a couple of different types of central lines you may see in the NICU. The most common is the one that's in the baby's belly button or the umbilicus. Nature provides us this wonderful access through two arteries and a vein in the baby's umbilical cord stump. We can place a small catheter in those, it does not hurt, and allows us to safely give the baby this TPN. After many days, that access becomes non-working. The cord begins to dry. If the baby is still requiring TPN or additional IV fluids, frequently a central line of some type is placed. The first type you may see in your baby is a percutaneous line or a PIC line or a PIV. It's usually in what we call the anacubital, the space between the upper and lower arm. A nurse practitioner or physician will come and numb the area, make a small incision, and then thread a very, very small catheter, smaller than a, a tiniest piece of thread almost. It threads up the arm, goes over near the right atrium of the heart. We take an x-ray and make sure it's in the right position and then we can use that to give your baby the TPN or additional IV fluids. If at some point in time the baby needs yet another central line and there's no other form of access, you may see a central line placed in the upper chest right under the clavicle or breastbone. The way that line is placed is that a surgeon will come, again numb the area, and thread a larger catheter that's actually sutured to the skin down near the heart and IV fluid is administered that way. Care around the line as far as infection and to make sure it doesn't come out is very paramount. So you may see dressings on it. We'll be a little bit more careful in how we move and handle the baby and just be very aware of our technique and managing it to prevent the baby getting an infection.